A young man who about 10 years ago made headlines, uh, was a renowned hero, both in New York, around the country, and around the world, for just a knee-jerk, once-in-a-lifetime moment that happens on a commute that could happen to any of us going through Penn Station on any given day. And this was a bit of the news coverage when it happened. Some people spend a lifetime in show business waiting for that one great moment, never knowing when or where it might happen. For one performer, it happened this week. Actor Chad Lindsay, who did something remarkable this week while waiting for the C train at New York's Penn Station. Chad Lindsay jumped onto the New York City subway tracks and rescued a man who passed out and fell off the platform. It was a moment he'd been unwittingly training for. His current role is in the off-Broadway play Casper Hauser, in which he picks up a fellow cast member who can't walk. You know, the, the train tracks start to shine when the reflected light right. of, the, of the train is headed at you. Lights, yeah. And I saw that, and I was like, okay, we need to get out of this hole, like, yeah. pronto. I'm a trained dancer and actor. When someone falls, I catch them. You do what your muscles are trained to do. I hopped up out of there, which I didn't think I could do, but at the point time, I was like, adrenaline. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. So I could have just been like, boing, <laughs> I felt like, anyway. <laughs> Two roles in one day, actor and lifesaver. It, it's so simple. I mean, you just, if you see somebody trip and fall down, you help them up. You know what I mean? Thanks. Welcome to the panel. Thank you. It's super comfortable being the face of selflessness. <laughs> <laughs> well, you're balancing out the, the guy who jumps out of airplanes with a bicycle. So, you know. <laughs> I want to see. First of all, before we get into your story, how many people here, if you think you saw somebody fall onto the subway tracks, would be the one to jump in after them and help them? There's a couple hand. Yeah, Chad, would you have been one with your hands up if asked that question ten? Uh, yeah, years I, ago? I don't know. I, I had never thought of it when it happened. You know, it didn't. I was new to New York, a relatively new New Yorker, and I know a little bit about trains and a little bit about how the subway track bed is organized, so I, I feel like, yeah, I would have. You know, there's a thing here that's about your level of competence and, and knowledge of yourself that, that <clears throat> I think is, is maybe the, the teachable moment for all of these instincts, which is that how can we take this instinct to con consistently and incrementally improve, right, and move that red line further and further and turn it into, uh, you know, a, a quest for competence among all of us that the more you know about yourself and what you're capable of doing, the more apt you are, the more likely you are to, to jump in when you're needed. 